inside Brunei Prince's luxurious billionaire lifestyle, Abdul Mateen and Abdul Malik. Hey everybody, welcome to Luxury Vault. Today we are going to go over inside Brunei Prince's luxurious billionaire lifestyle, Abdul Mateen and Abdul Malik. Make sure to watch until then, because it's one of the most interesting parts I've ever seen. There are many things we don't know about the Asian countries of Brunei, a tiny nation on the island of Brunei. But one thing we do know is it has a prince not shy of flashing his wealth. At the age of 26, His Royal Highness Prince Abdul Mateen shares photos of his insane life and adventures with his 7300,000 followers on Instagram, where he's known simply as Mateen. Before starting the video, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe to never miss out on any of our videos. In the small Asian nation of Brunei, Sultan Hassan al Balkia is a one man show. He is not only Brunei's absolute monarch and supreme leader of the Islamic faith, but also country's prime minister, finance minister, foreign affairs, and trade minister, superintendent of police, defense minister, and commander of the armed forces and even Chancellor of the National University. A personal wealth estimated at $20 billion has earned him a place among the world's richest rulers. The Sultan 72 has introduced a brutal new criminal code in his tiny country, which is the first in East Asia to elevate Sharia law to the national level. According to the report, the palace in which Sultan Hassan al balkia lives is made up of gold, the palace named Istana Nur al Iman Palace was built in the year 1984 and it is spread over an area of 2 million square feet. The dome of this palace is studded with 22 karat gold. The palace has more than 1700 rooms, 257 bathrooms, and 5 swimming pools. Apart from 110 garages, there are air conditioned stables for 200 horses. Sultan Hassan al Balkia owns 7000 luxury cars. Sultan has 600 Rolls Royce and 300 Ferraris in his own collection of cars. According to a report by BornRich.com, Hassan al Balkia has several private jets equipped with the luxury facilities. He has Boeing 747-400, Boeing 767-200, and Airbus A340-200 jets. According to the report, Boeing 747-400 jet is plated with the gold and it also has many facilities, including a living room and bedroom. The laws, among other things, permitted death by stoning for gay sex and adultery, amputation for theft, and public flogging for abortion, and have been decried as cruel and inhuman by the United Nations. While the Sultan has taken an ultra-conservative hardline approach to law enforcement in his kingdom, behind the scenes, his life is a whirlwind of extreme wealth and decadence. From his fleet of private passenger jets to having Michael Jackson sing at his own birthday party, the second longest reigning monarch in the world, behind Elizabeth II, the Sultan has been on Brunei's throne for 52 years. After inheriting it from his father, the royal family loved the British jewelers Asprey and Garrett so much they bought it until it was sold five years later. To really get a sense of how wealthy this guy is, look no further than his extra wagon 15th birthday back in 1996. Sultan Hassanul splashed out $36.9 million on two weeks of celebrations for himself that included a polo match and extra vegan gala dinner with beloga caviar on the menu. He paid Michael Jackson $25.8 million to perform at three concerts to mark the occasions. The Sultan married his cousin, Raja Estri Panjirian Anak Haja Saliha, in 1965 and because of polygame is legal in Brunei, she remains his wife and queen consort despite him marrying and discovering two other women. He has 12 children and footed the bill for five of their weddings. When his oldest son and heir, Crown Prince Al Muhtadi Billah, married in 2004, Whitney Houston was paid $10.1 million to sing at the reception. The international response to Brunei's new laws has cast a dark spotlight on the Sultan's overseas investments, especially luxury hotels that are now facing bycots such as London's The Dorcaster and the Beverly Hills Hotel in LA. Prince Malik Abdul Malik is a prince of Brunei. He is the third son of Sultan Hassan al Balkia by his first wife, Queen Saliha. Prince Malik tied the knot in a wedding ceremony that made the headlines all over the globe. He got married to then 22 years old Dianku Rabiatul Adavia Panjurian Haji Balkia, and their wedding was nothing short of magnificent. The event took place over the course of 10 days and has been referred to as one of the most lavish weddings of the planet. 
It was attended by more than 6,000 guests including royal families from around the world, foreign diplomats as well as political figures. From the bridal bouquet to the newly wedded couple's outfit, and even the thrones placed inside the ceremonial room were embellished with pure gold, diamonds, and precious stones decorations. Prince Mateen Prince Mateen is the fourth son of the Sultan of Brunei. This 26 years old is very famous on Instagram. Mateen is an athlete who loves to play polo and he's also a boxer. Like other princes, he also took military training at Royal Military Academy. He is indeed very handsome and very single. For the every Jew, one would normally opt for the cats and dogs as a fluffy companion, but not the royalty hunk. Prince Mateen owns exotic white tiger cubs and ocelots and occasionally shares photos of his beloved companions on his social media. Additionally, Prince Mateen is also known for his love for horses. The prince was recently awarded the RAF wing badge, qualifying him as a helicopter pilot. He trained at the Defence Helicopter Flying School at RAF Shawbury in the UK. His father owns his own helicopter, so he definitely has a lot of opportunity for practice. The prince is continuing his training and his the next goal is to become a Black Hawk helicopter pilot. The prince holds the rank of second lieutenant which he earned in 2011 at the commissioning officer course at the Royal Military Academy Sandhurst in the UK. The course is 44 weeks long and very grueling. At one point, he was made to dig trenches for three days non-stop. And if he started to fall asleep, the commanding officers would kick him to wake him up. He also had to walk up seven mountains within 24 hours during a race that spanned 46 miles. Despite the hardships of the curse, he attributes it to making him a strong both mentally and physically and calls his graduation from the academy. The greatest thing he's ever done. When he was growing up, his idol was a football star, David Beckham. The extent of his own athletic pursuits is almost too long to list. He enjoys snorkeling, skydiving, golfing, skiing, rowing, boxing, badminton, and horseback riding. Polo, a historically royal sport, is also one of his favorites. Mateen says he enjoys the complexities of the sport, along with the dexterity, multitasking, and control that are required. He even represented Brunei at the Southeast Asian Games that were held in Malaysia in 2017, competing alongside his sister Princess Azema Nematul Balkia. When he is not playing sports or attending to princely responsibilities, he says that he likes to spend his time hanging out with his friends and watching films. According to GQ, which interviewed him in 2016, he ends every sentence with thank you. The prince says despite the luxurious that come with his position, it's important to remain grounded and humble at the same time. And he credits his three closest friends with keeping him down to earth. Being a royal figure that's worth billions of dollars sure comes with a lot of benefits. One of the advantages included access to the benefits of outfits, as seen in some of the pictures uploaded on the social media. Prince Mateen's war robe is filled with the lavish designer brands. As revealed by Nine Figure Life, he has liking to the London tailor shops selling the world's most expensive suits that can cost up to $15,000 per piece. Not only that, Prince Mateen has a taste for expensive watches. Among his collection is a Rolex Daytona 11650 which is priced at $26,000. Another masterpiece that he has been seen donning is the 18 karat wild gold Patek Philip Notelius Perpetual Calendar, which is said to be valued at around $1 to $4,000. The Istana Nurul Iman Palace, measuring over 2.2 million square feet. The interior design of the palace is decorated with gold and diamond embellishments. Among his 1788 rooms, the palace has five massive swimming pools a banquet hall that can accommodate up to 5,000 guests at once, a mosque with a capacity of 15,000 people, and an air-conditioned stable for 200 polo horses. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to check out the following videos here. Thank you.